very much one basic characteristic of loving is to be interested in others spiritual growth what is spiritual growth whenever one person is related to another person hmm? whenever one person is related to another person the effect of one person upon the other their mutual effect upon each other can be of two types one is that b becomes dependent upon a b already had a mind that wanted dependency and now b has become all the more dependent upon a b has become attached to a and a is relishing the attachment a is saying that c he loves me so much b loves me so much that is the reason why it has become attached because after all attachment is a sign of love hmm a has filled up b's mind so completely a says that b is now so completely in love with me that he or she is all the time now thinking of me so obviously there is no space for contemplation introspection b used to be a reader b used to be a reader every night before sleeping she would read at least for 2 hours she typically went to bed at around 10:30 and would read till around midnight and then sleep now a knows that she retires at 10:30 so he calls her up at 10:30 every night and now these two talk for 2 hours and then she sleeps at 12:30 now obviously the time that have gone in could have gone into reading is being consumed by a now what is the effect that is that a is having upon b this is what is the opposite of spiritual growth the mind was already cluttered and the effect of a upon b's life is that b's mind is all the more cluttered now this is what our normal love does to the other talk to me for 4 hours on phone is that the best use of his or her time you are destroying the other person you are the biggest enemy he can ever have you are not giving him or her space you are not allowing her for aloneness now b can become conditioned to such an extent that one day when a realizes that this is the effect he is having upon b he says no i'll no more call you up you must read b says surely there is somebody else in your life now <laughs> who are you seeing these days who is that bitch i'll kill her b will not even realize what is meant by growth what is love and look at the people who say that we love somebody what are they filling the others mind with their own beliefs their own beliefs you know another aspect to it let me come to it whenever two young people not only young if right till the middle age they come in touch with each other the man would always remind the woman about his body or her body rather he looks at her and she realizes he is greatly interested in her body and this mind which would otherwise have been calm now gets filled up with thoughts of the body the very presence of the male makes the woman body centric and vice versa 
Now, he or she used to be a calm, nice, decent individual. But since this person has entered their lives, all the time they are sexually aroused. And when they are not sexually aroused, they would get some message or a picture or a thought, some kind of reminder, which would make them all body, rather all genitals. From head to toe, this woman is only now genitals. Nothing else has remained. The brains have all been eaten out. That's what the man has done to her. Made a huge genital out of her being. And that's what he has done to the man as well. Both sides. Now is this love? This is exactly what spiritual growth is not. Your presence is reducing the other person to a corpse, to a mere huge piece of flesh. And is that not what husbands do to their wives? I mean the husband is horny and the two are on the bed. The husband wants to have a go at her and she is reading Krishnamurti. Now what is the husband going to do? <laughs> the two are lying side by side. The husband is ready to attack and she is with Krishnamurti. Now what is the husband going to do? Tell me. I mean many of you are married so you know what happens. Krishnamurti goes to the... <laughs> this old man is he sexier than me <laughs> this is the effect that lovers have upon each other and she used to be a nice woman and then he will get her pregnant and now she is all body at least for 9 months she is nothing but the body body is constantly reminding her of this and that and then the baby comes and she has to definitely remain a body this is the effect that so called lovers have upon each other where would you find minimum of reading happening when people are in love then they only read SMS <laughs> and WhatsApp. That's what, yeah, my daily reading, WhatsApp. <laughs> and you say, I'm in love. Bliss. And it's so different to even imagine, right? So, so difficult to imagine. Can there be lovers who actually wish each other well? Is it possible to have a husband who in the middle of sex realizes, Hey, did you do your daily reading today? No, I am getting off. <laughs> Where is your book? Read. First read, only then. Finish off your 20 pages. And she is saying, no, 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 that can be written tomorrow. No, today. Otherwise, how will you attend the Sunday session? <laughs> <laughs> From where will you find such a man? <laughs> you have wives and you have husbands who are of an entirely different nature. Where do you hide Krishnamurti by the way in your house? <laughs> Under the pillow, somewhere over the AC. <laughs> Some dirty book has been found. What is this? <laughs> so this is what you are reading these days. Have you fallen so low? Do you see the effect it will have upon Chunnu? <laughs> this is the example you are setting. This dirty old man. And that is the quality of our love. I have seen people come here. And their spouses would wait for two hours there, down. But they will not climb up. Spouses. Fathers, mothers, friends, they'll wait for two hours downstairs. They'll not climb up. And if I happen to see them, ah, this is that man whose face keeps <laughs> popping out of the, her laptop all the time. <laughs> this is what my son said. <laughs> 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 now 
what is this is this love is this love do you really wish each other well hmm if your wife does not like you coming here does she will you wish you well or is she really an enemy help her i'm not saying that kill your enemy i'm saying help your enemy help her she needs treatment and if i am i am able to get him along with me then that's the treatment that's the treatment that's the treatment no no as in if he is interested because he will be here only if he is interested yes no he not interested not really not, not always he might be here because you are here so it's all right become mm. the carrot lure him in there a very pertinent question the one basic characteristic of real love is that you help the other person really grow and that growth is nothing but self revelation self awareness is through your presence are you really helping the other person or drowning him in some kind of nasha hmm? 